Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Panini Mosaic Basketball. Team All Edition. It's a 10 box break. Pick your team number one with some break credit being given away. Um, I don't know why that says early bird right here. Because you win break at the end of the break. Top two names will find another first 20 teams sold. Oh, that's the early bird, yeah. First 20 teams sold count as double entries, and the next 10 will just count as one entry. So that's what the early bird is. Uh, no vet common ship, and it's 10 boxes. Now, this is actually a 12 box case. Nick priced it as a 10 box break, though. So those two boxes, we'll, we'll figure out what to do with those other two boxes. Well, maybe they'll go back into the wild or something like that. But. We're going to have to select two boxes that are going to be out of this break. Nick might have been thinking of blaster cases, I think, which are 20 boxes. All right, so here's how we're going to do it. we got... You can see on the top camera right there, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six rows of two. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna roll the die and there's be one, two, three, four, five, six. And then whatever row that is, those are the two box that won't be in this break. All right. So good luck. One, so it's gonna be the first row right there. So these two boxes, We'll be out to make it a 10 box break. All right, good luck everybody. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Perfect. Oh, and here's the team list. Big thanks to this group right here on the second. Now, if your name is highlighted in green right there, that's the first 20. So those first 20 names will be doubled up for the purpose of the promo and the other 10 names that are not highlighted. You'll still get entries. You'll still be part of the promo. Alex, what's up? Personal boxes are only done on Instagram Live, not here. Well, won't let you view live. Were you banned from our Instagram, Alex? Maybe you were being a bad boy. You should be able to see it unless you were banned. But we, won't, we, we don't do it here. You can hit us up on Instagram and maybe they can give you on the, the DMs. Maybe they'll figure it out once, uh, once Jason comes back from the dinner break. He'll be able to reach back out to you and, and maybe troubleshoot that issue. Oh, you've never visited a site before. Well, yeah, all, all personal boxes are done on Instagram Live only. That's at Jaspi's Rakes on Instagram. They're not live right now because they're, they're on a dinner break. Jason is your host there. But, yeah, follow us on Instagram at Jaspi's Rakes. And if you have notifications set, you'll, you'll know usually. Sometimes that's a little buggy, but usually Instagram will let you know when we go live. And then that's where they'll do personal boxes for you. All right, so first team all box. So the, uh, I think the gold parallels are a little less common than the other parallels. And obviously we're looking for gold parallels of guys like this, Anthony Edwards. That'll be for Nicholas and the T-Wolves. So commons won't ship. So Kobe White, Diallo won't ship, but obviously rookie cards will ship. That's an insert that will ship. That's Zeke Naji gold that obviously ships. Um, finals MVP, that's an insert, so that'll ship. 
Zeke Naja will go to Denver. That's going to be for Nico. Obviously, that's a refractor and a rookie. That'll ship. Brandon Clark's Red Wave, so that will ship. I think this should give you an idea. The Siakam will ship. Jabari Parker ships. And that Anthony Edwards National Pride Red Wave is nice. That will go to Nicholas and the T-Wolves. All right. Just like that, box one in the books. So, yeah, that's what we're looking for. We're looking for uh, exclusive scripts, Red Wave, Gold Wave, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. The Team All Edition. So this is... This is an addition. The checklist is pretty much the same, is the same, just different parallels. They release, I think they sent, I don't know what the exact timing is, but I'm pretty sure it's like, um, they'll release this in Asia first. Tmall is like a big, looks like Amazon type company in China or Asia. And um, they'll have it out there for X amount of time. And then after that, Whatever stock is left over is like bought back by distributors and gets back into gets back in our hands. It's generally how it works. And it's, depending on the product, it could be different time periods or whatever. Gilo, what's going on? Lakers about to tip off. I don't think, I think it's just on local TV. I don't know if that's a national game unless you're a NBA League Pass person. But Lakers are hosting the Pelicans. There's Reggie Bullock. Sadiq Bay, red wave for the Pistons. And gold wave. These cards are a little slippery here. Gold wave rookie? No. Gold wave auto porter junior for Orlando. Rookie red wave. Tyrese Halliburton. Still King's edition here for Royal. And a Lamello ball. Rookie card. Charlotte Royal with the Hornets. What's the story with LaMelo Ball? Sprained ankle, that's what it was. I think he's I don't think he's in the hasn't really been in the lineup. But we need him to get back into action. That'd be good for the hobby. All right, next box. Sorry, we saw a pretty exciting overtime game. Jason Tatum had a monster dunk to send the Celtics Cavs game into overtime. But then, Cavs are able to hang on. They won by a point. Lakers Pelicans just underway. What are what other games do we have going on today? A lot of finals. Raptors destroyed the Spurs 143 to 100. Bucks beat the Pistons 116 to 91. Clippers beat the Rockets 109 to 101. Bulls beat the uh, the Hornets 106 to 88. Hawks beat the Knicks 112 to 99. Heat beat the Kings 110 to 107. Final score of that Celtics Cavs game 114 to 113. Wizards beat the Sixers 121 to 111. And I think the national game Grizzlies at Trailblazers 
At the end of the first, Grizzlies up 30 to 23. Just, just 2 2 at the beginning of this Lakers Pelicans game. Westbrook coming off the bench the last couple of games. I think it's looked in a very, very small sample size. has looked, uh, looked like a good move thus far. All right, let's see what we have in here. Got an Aaron Naismith rookie gold wave. For the Celtics, that's going to be for Nico. Sadiq Bay, Red Wave. Pistons, that'll be for Chris. Rookie Gold Wave. No, Drew Holiday, Gold Wave. Bogdan still ships, that's a refractor. Rookie Red Wave, Jay Sean Tate. Nice. Uh, Rockets. How's Jay Sean Tate been doing? He, he showed some some flashes of, uh, of some sort of brilliance. No, Jay Sean Tate. No longer with the Rockets. No, maybe not. Maybe he's out. Maybe he's injured. He was out with a uh, ankle issue. Ankle issue for Jay Sean Tate. Ooh, and a nice red wave. NBA debut insert LaMelo Ball, Charlotte. It's going to be for a while. All right, next box. Again, you know, a lot of broken ankles, twisted ankles out there. Oh, come on, guys, got, got to get those rebounds. No Brandon Ingram in this uh, in this Pelicans Lakers game. I think Jason was saying he was out with like a concussion, Could knocked his head around, I guess, with somebody or something. Junior Gold Wave. Got a Jordan and Wara Red Wave, rookie Red Wave for the Bucks and a National Pride LaMelo Ball for Roeville and the Hornets. Anthony Edwards NBA debut. Man, why do they call it Panini 1 and 1? 1 and 1 doesn't exist in the NBA. I guess kind of not. I guess they were thinking of just one bucket and and the and one. You know, you 
I don't know if you're that kind of guy, Gilo, when you play pickup basketball, when you think you're fouled, you know, and you still make the bucket, do you, do you go, and one? Do you do one of those, Gilo? And one. Malachi Flynn, <laughs> Raptors gold wave, rookie gold wave for Nico. Patrick Williams, rookie, red wave, NBA debut insert. More Anthony Edwards for Nicholas and the Teals. I guess they're kind of thinking of it as not as one point, but uh, one bucket and one. I, f I forget. It's been a minute or two since we've done Panini one and one. Maybe there's only two cards in the box. I mean, we'll find out this Friday. You can pre-order Panini one and one right now. Jaspiescasebreaks.com in the basketball section. Pre-order today. Lock in your team. Drops on Friday. Friday, November fourth. And one. Next box, good luck. Got a gold wave, Kelly Aubrey Jr. Nice little color match there. Theo Maladon, red wave, rookie, red wave. Lamelo Ball, NBA debut, Roel and the Hornets. Oh, so the basketball is one base or parallel and then the encased. That's what Rex is saying. And one. And one! Monty Morris, Gold Wave. Larry Nance Jr., Silver. And a James Wiseman. Rookie Red Wave NBA debut card for Dwayne and the Warriors. Warriors come out to play. Um, yes, I think that's what it refers to. The bucket, the bucket and one. I don't know why Gilo keeps saying it doesn't exist in the NBA, but the bucket and one. I don't know. I don't think those titles are, uh, I think those titles shouldn't be taken too literally. Gilo, explain yourself. What do you mean that doesn't exist? I'm, 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 I know you're trying to make a joke, but it's not landing, so you have to explain it. It doesn't exist in the... Are you saying and ones don't exist in the NBA? I feel like I feel like they're giving away fouls all the time in the NBA. And one happens all the time. Too many fouls, maybe. Oh, the NCAA has the one and one rule. Oh, make the make and one. That's right. They do have that rule. No, I think I think I think they're referring to the bucket and one. One bucket and the foul. The extra bucket. The extra.
free throw. But yeah, I mean, Panini won football. What, what's, what, what does that really mean? I think once they started with that, then they were kind of like, oh, I guess we can kind of loosely reference <laughs> in a basketball, an NBA scenario. And then I think by the time they got around to baseball, they were like, I guess, guess we're doing three and two and kind of lean into that. And we got a gold wave, Alexei Pokusevsky. Uh, Woon with the Thunder. That's a nice one to get. Thunder's got a lot of youngsters on that team. There's Xavier Tillman, Red Wave. Rookie Red Wave for Roil and Memphis. And we've got an Anthony Edwards NBA debut Red Wave for Nicholas and the T-Wolves. Baseball call it full count. Basketball call it triple double. Well, see, then I think that goes away from the one thing. Because once you start, because it's all the same design as Panini One NFL. So you got to think about branding, Gilo. They're trying to brand it as the part of the One series. So they're kind of shoehorning in like three and two. Three and two. And they're trying to shoehorning in numbers, I guess, at this point. Yeah, that's right, Logan. They don't teach 10 and 2 anymore, Rex. Come on. Come on, Rex. Do you even know how to drive, Rex? What do they say, Logan? I think it's it's 9 and 3, right? Because at 10 and 2, with airbags, you have a chance of having of breaking your wrists or, or your hands flying into your face as a count of the airbag. So I think they say nine and three, if not, um, if not like four and seven. All right, yeah, the airbags. Right, yeah, Terry's like, if I see 10 and two on the road, you steer clear, right. Because I, I don't do, I haven't done 10 and 2 in decades. Yeah, they. They don't teach anymore, Rex. Rex, not, not much of a driver, I guess. I always look to optimize my, uh, my abilities on the road. It's Jalen Smith, Red Wave, rookie. <laughs> well, they teach when everything's a Tesla, right? At that point, you may not have to worry. You might, you can just, things will just drive itself. Rookie Red Wave, Tyrese Maxey for the Sixers. That'll be for Roweel. More Anthony Edwards is this for the Timberwolves, Nicholas. All right, Terry's saying kids these days, they don't want to drive. 
because of Uber. Well, what happens when... What happens when they're... I mean, at some point, if that's the case, you eventually run out of Uber drivers, right? So then what happens when the Uber drivers go extinct because no one's driving? Wow, Rex, you've never used, you were taught 10 and 2, but you refused to do 10 and 2. Come on, Rex. You lucked out this time. I go 9 and 3 when I'm doing 150 in the Porsche. That's right, Philo. You don't see F1 drivers hand 10 and 2. I don't think you even see NASCAR drivers at 10 and 2. You've done Uber a few times in Chicago, that's it. You've seen too many horror stories. It's not that bad. I've taken, I've taken a ride share service zillions of times. It's just fine. It's all, all, that, uh, all that Fox News trying to scare you, Rex. They'd have you think that LA is crawling with homeless people. There's Lamello, Charlotte Hornets, Roil. No, F1 drivers don't have a full steering wheel. No, that's true. <laughs> Got to get out of town more, Rex. Aren't you? Isn't your family doing that road trip? We'll have to. You'll have to put in some shifts. All right, one sixty in the Lambo. That's right, Terry. Nine and three. That's where my hands are. Driving the Lambo. Got a Vernon Carey Jr. rookie red wave. Rex is a, is a 7 5 guy right here. No, I'm, sometimes I'm just 12. Sometimes I'm just 12. Just one hand on 12. You know, depending on how I'm feeling. <laughs> right. Now, Lambos are meant to be run hard, Terry. That's what, that's what a sports car is supposed to do. Otherwise. Otherwise, that the the oil just kind of settles. So you don't want to do that. You want to keep that, keep keep all the the Lambo fluids coursing through its powerful, powerful veins. <laughs> someone's gonna someone's gonna just look at this part of this video, Terry, and be like, Jaspie's case brace claiming they have Lambo money. No, it's a joke. You dumbs, the dumbs out there. Ethereum is down a little bit, huh? Oh yeah, and Logan was saying DoorDash hasn't been profitable for a year. I don't know. I, uh, I was reading something the other day that a lot of times, like for example, I think, was it, was it DoorDash? Someone reported like, maybe it was Uber or something like that. They reported that they were, instead of losing $2 billion last year, they only lost $1 billion last year, and their stock price went up. I think mostly based on um, that the fact that the, the size of the pie had grown, their growth. You added more users. But they weren't profitable. They were losing money, but not as much money. And then their stock price went up. 
There's Aaron Naismith. <laughs> right, Terry. I'm too uh, uh, I'm too short to be able to do that. Actually, I don't have I don't have the length to be able to to do that. Why won't you ever have food delivered to you? That's one of the greatest things that that life can provide. Nothing better than than waking up and having a having a McDonald's sausage egg McMuffin and a piping hot coffee right at your door. Two par two par <laughs> Rex watching that Fox News again. Just getting scared. I didn't know you were that much. Uh, Rex is like pearl clutching. Oh dear, someone may may spit in my food. I saw it on TV. I don't know. Maybe uh, actually, maybe that's maybe. Uh, Maybe this, I don't know, maybe in your part of town, Rex, your part of the world, I wonder if there's more likelihood of people being jerks. Maybe in the bigger city? I, I have no idea. But yeah, delivery is great. No, Logan won't order food either. Uh, Thunder Break. Do I think Elements will run tonight? If if it sells out, yes. That's the, that's up to you, not me. Whenever people ask, do you think something will run tonight? I have no idea what's going to happen. It's all spontaneous. But if you buy spots and encourage other people to buy spots and sell out a break, yeah, then it'll, then it'll run. Simple as that. Thank you, Gilo. So I don't know. I don't know when anything's going to run at any given time. I have no idea. That's what makes this exciting. Every day, I don't know what's going to happen on any given day. There's Tyrese Halliburton, Gold Wave. Uh, I do listen to some podcasts. I, I just don't have time to listen to podcasts. But a... Ooh. And a Calvin Nat autograph. Not, not too many autos in this. But the ones I've been listening to most consistently lately, there's a golf podcast I listen to called No Laying Up. So I'll listen to that golf podcast. And uh, I will also listen to uh, the It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia podcast. Man, I, I, Rex, what else are you scared of? Rex, do you not do Airbnbs either? I mean, at that point, why even stay in a hotel? All right, friends, and that is that. There's a Jay Sean Tate Red Wave and a Jordan Wara Rookie Mosaic Parallel. Nice. All right, now let's give away some money. The Portland autograph will go to Nico, by the way. All right, so let's flip back over here.
Now you see highlighted in green right here, and you can see count 20 in the bottom right hand corner. So those are the first 20 teams picked up. Those guys get double entries. There you go. So that's 20 right there. And then the rest of you are actually, let's double you up. So there's one, there's two. And the rest of you, you still get an entry. Mm -hmm. Let's get that. So there should be 20 plus 20, 40, there should be 50 on the list. There's count 50 right there. And top two, actually I did the entry list already. Top two, $500 a break credit. Pretty nice. So let's gather all your names in here. Fingers crossed, good luck. Let's roll it and randomize it. Four and a three, seven times. One. Two, three, four, five, six, and once more, seventh and final time. Fingers crossed. Good luck. Drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. I need a drum roll feature here. You can do a drum roll at home. You can use your fingers and tap on your desk. Do it with me. Oh, this is the rough spot. Oh. Nico, I hope your name's up there. That, that's the very close but no cigar spot. Um, what was I doing this? I'm more like a joint. No, no cigar spot. Um, but thank you, Nico, for giving it a shot. But only the top two can get that break credit, and that's going to be Nicholas. Congrats to you. And there you go, Nico. You're up there. So it wasn't that bad. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for making this happen. Guys, um, Check your emails. That's where I'll send you. They'll arrive to you as a gift card code. They never expire. You don't have to use all of it at once. It'll save your balance. And if you're lucky enough to have multiple gift card codes, I'm pretty sure you can combine them as well. Thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next basketball break. Bye-bye.